There were a lot of things happening on the Red Lake Reservation today, from honoring elders to four different groundbreakings. Lakeland News reporter Sherelle Moore tells us what each event will bring to the Red Lake Nation. Today will go down in history for Red Lake. Not only did they kick off their 8th annual Elder Summit, but four big projects have officially started as well. We anticipate a nine-month construction schedule, and uh, uh, we're looking forward to, again, improving the health, safety, and welfare of the citizens of Red Lake with these uh, four facilities. Each of the four buildings will provide a much-needed service to the reservation. The new Chemical Dependency Treatment Center will provide help to tribal members with alcohol and drug abuse problems, as well as provide education to its members and work on prevention techniques. The treatment center, where we have here today, has been a long time of coming because we're, we're basically using old residence houses that we've added, added uh, new additions onto them, but over time they've just taken a lot of, a lot of abuse. Both Red Lake and Ponema will be getting a new fire department. They have for their safety, for their new fire departments, their buildings are old, and to have the new, new buildings, and they're also going to get some fire trucks in the near future. They'll have a lot more room and probably a lot more employees. The next new building being added to Red Lake is a new dialysis center. That will be added next to the Red Lake Hospital. Dialysis center is needed, so a lot of our dialysis patients go off the reservation and they'll, be, they'll do their um, process here on our, back here on our reservation. Today was a very busy day for Red Lake Nation. There was not one, not two, but four different groundbreakings in Red Lake and Ponema. But of course, before each groundbreaking, Red Lake paid thanks to their elders with their annual elders gathering held at the Seven Clans Casino. Indian word for elder is Gichi Ayaya. Gichi Ayaya would be plural. And that translates into someone who has done great things and lived a long time. And we revere these these elders. An elder in Red Lake is described as anyone 55 and up. For this conference, the main goal is to let the elders know that they're appreciated and inform them about everything going on with the reservation. The elders conference will go on until tomorrow. Then the reservation will switch gears to a youth conference that starts Wednesday. Overall, with an action-packed day like this one, Chairman Siki Sr. says Red Lake's future is looking pretty bright. These are needed for our people here on the reservation and also will create jobs for them. Reporting in Red Lake and Ponema, Sherelle Moore, Lakeland News. The four groundbreakings in Red Lake and Ponema have been in the planning stages for the past three years. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.